Welcome back to Google Guru, the informational video series where we'll teach you how to do everything from basic to advanced tasks in the world of Google Apps. Today we're going to teach you how to take advantage of one of Google's newly released features, and that's Offline Calendar. These specific instructions I'm about to go through are for um, using the browser Google Chrome. Uh, Google also offers offline capabilities through other browsers like Firefox and Internet Explorer, but um, it's through a different mechanism called Google Gears. Google Chrome actually does offline through HTML5, and we're going to show you how to activate that. So from within your Google Calendar, as you can see on my screen, you'll want to go to the top right-hand corner and click on the wrench. The bottom option will probably be offline. Click on offline and you'll be prompted to install the offline calendar application from the web store. So click install from web store and you'll be taken to the Google Chrome web store. Go ahead and click add to Chrome and that'll install this little extension in Chrome for us. Gonna go ahead and launch the app. And here we go. You see that green swirling circle next to offline? That means that um, offline sync is working. So there's a few things that you should know um, if you're having problems accessing offline calendar after you get this set up. Um, you cannot have your browser set to clear cookies every time you close it. So to change that, you wanna go to preferences by clicking that little icon right there. Let's see here. It's actually called Options in my browser. And then from Options, you want to go to Under the Hood, click on Content Settings. And if you have this box checked, which says clear cookies and other site and plug-in data when I close my browser. You have to uncheck that to allow Google Calendar to work because it does have to retain those cookies while you're offline. Um, that's it for today. Uh, we hope you're enjoying Google Guru. And as always, you can find more videos at googleguru.com. Thanks again.